In this program, we are asked to multiply two 8-bit numbers, which are 02H and 03H. So normally, multiplication can be done with addition. Since we don't have any instruction like mul in 8085, so this is not present in 8085. So we rather solve this using addition. But how do we do this? So basically, 2 times 3 is equivalent to addition of the values 2 3 times or it's equivalent to addition of the value 3 2 times. We can take any one of the approach in solving this problem. First of all, let's load these two values in our registers. We'll load 0 to in register A and we'll load the value 0 3 in register B. Also, this value 0 3 is going to act as our counter. Now, for storing the multiplication result, we'll use the accumulator. So, we'll move this particular value that we're supposed to add in to some other registers using move. So, let's move it to C. Okay. Now, we'll clear our accumulator or else we could also have done it uh, directly in this way we could have loaded c here with value 0 to uh, instead of moving this the accumulator would have, would have been empty but uh, it's actually fine we're good until now now what we're supposed to do is we are supposed to add accumulator with the value c what this would do is this would do accumulator is equal to accumulator plus c which means the value in accumulator is going to be 0 0 plus 0 2 which is which is 0 2 now we would decrease our counter here using the instruction dcr b which means the value of b is going to come to 0 2 we keep on doing this until and unless the value b reaches to 0 so we can compare the zero flag actually and then place a condition based on the zero flag so what i'm going to do is jump on non-zero j and z and then give a string tag here called do and and until now this the value of b is zero we keep on going to this particular line here now once we get out of this line we have our result in the accumulator we're going to store it in memory location 4000h and then be done with the program then halt the program let me explain it to you once again let me erase this part first so initially the value of a is 0 to h the value of b is 0 3 h now we move the value of a to c which means c also gets 0 to h and then we remove accumulator value and then reset it to 00h which means this value does not exist now right now what we're going to do is we're going to add c to the accumulator which means a plus c is going to be 2 so in the first loop in the first loop uh, a plus c is going to be 2 which means the value of a is going to be 0 to h the value of b it was 0 3 initially now we've decreased it by 1 so this will be 0 to h again and then we check if this value is a zero value or a non-zero value since this is a non-zero value we we go back to the code here now so in the second iteration let me write down second look we've added c to a again so so value in c is 0 to the value in a is also 0 to which means we now get 0 for h and then we again decrease the value in register b now it comes back to 0 1 h we still check if this particular value is a zero or a non-zero value since it is a non-zero value the instruction that we've written reverts this back to the tag here and then the particular line at c here so in the third iteration or the third loop we add the value of c to accumulator so c is 0 to a is 
0, 4, which means 0, 4 plus 0, 2 is going to be 0, 6. We decrease the value of the register B. Now, B becomes 0, 0. Now, we come to this particular step here. Now, since this is a 0 value, the non-zero condition will not be satisfied, which means the program will not go up. Instead, it will go down here. So, now the multiplication result is present in accumulator. What we are going to do is, we are going to move 0, 4 to memory location 4000H. And that will be our answer here. So, this is the complete program.